Hello everyone. Welcome back to Forever Freaky Funko. That's my girl Sophia. <laughs> my name's Anthony. Thanks for joining me. And today we have a special unboxing to do. I say special because these are Father's Day mystery boxes that Spastic Pops did. So I'm going to show you those there. So we're searching for two one of two metallic children of the force which if you know me i desperately want that pop and that awesome comic-con exclusive of the alien so father's day so let me let you know about this one so it says here father's day three pop blind box there's going to be 100 boxes 40 dollars each free shipping in the u.s Every 10th order gets a $20 gift certificate. So he, uh, Curtis over at Spastic Pops, it looks like according to that, he gave away 10 $20 certificates. I did not get one, but that's okay. So it says two commons and one chase or exclusive or vaulted pop per box. So, um, do, 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 do. So it says maximum one box per order for this box, and then parentheses, you may place additional orders, which I did. I ordered two boxes. Um, and I don't think there's a guarantee here of price. Um, do, 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 $40 each. So they're $40 each. That's what I paid for them. So I paid 80 bucks free shipping. I ordered two boxes at two different times. So I ordered one box, and then later on, I ordered another box. Um, so I actually have one box arrived, um, and then the next day, no, I think I think they both arrived on the same day, but they were shipped out on two different days. Like one was shipped out, and then the other one was shipped out. So I'm assuming my first order was shipped first, so I did put a number one on that box, and then the second box I ordered um, was shipped second, because it shows the ship date. But I got them on the same day. They came here on the same day. So my daughter's going to help me, so I'm going to show you. Um, the boxes, I'm going to cut them open and then she's going to hand them to me so I know they're facing forward. She's going to be my little assistant today. So what do you have to say about that? I'm excited. You're excited for what? Handing you boxes. <laughs> so, are you excited to see what's in the boxes? <laughs> I'm excited to see what's in the boxes, but I'm also nervous. Um, I'm nervous for you. Well, yeah. So... I got some pretty cool pops in the background. You see that? You see the two blue chromes in the background? Those are both from mystery boxes that I have opened recently. So I've gotten some pretty decent pulls. So let's see what we have in here. Now, the rules, Sophia. The rules for you, my lovely assistant. <laughs> there's going to be... Um, how these are shipped is there's going to be three different types of packaging. Meaning, you're going to have a regular Funko Pop without a protector. Okay, just like you see in the stores. Um, you might get a Funko Pop. This is just an example. Goose the cat. So you see how this one is plastic and it's like a pop protector, but it's like a soft protector? Yeah, it's thin. Okay. So you might have one of those in the box, right? Yeah. Or they might put a hard stack in the box. Now this is just an example. Of course I put Dark Phoenix in a hard stack, but this is what a hard stack feels like. Pretty heavy, and it's definitely a more secure protector, all right? So, if there's a hard stack or a soft stack, I want you to hand me that box last, okay? So there should be three pops per box, or if there's, I'm sure Children of the Forest, there's probably only two in the box. I would guess, I don't know. But, so... If it comes in a protector, hand me that one last. We on the same page? Yes. We Gucci? Okay. okay. So, can you put that on the floor for your dad? And this on the floor, just so we can have them out of the way. And, if you can go back over to your position. We will do these pretty quickly, guys. Um, so, this is the first box that came to me. So, and then this is the second box. So we're going to do this one first and this is the second box that came to me based off of shipping. Okay? So we got two boxes, two different sizes. 
which I find pretty curious. It makes me curious on maybe there's something special. I don't know. We'll see. So what I'm going to do, Sophia, I'm going to open my first box. Now, there, there might be bubble wrap and stuff in here, so if you have to kind of fight through that, I'm perfectly okay. 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 Now, put that on one side of the table. Okay. So I want you to hand me all three, one at a time, from that box first, okay? But before we get started, okay. we're going to open up both packages. It's going to be easier to hand it to me, uh, for her to hand it to me too, because I want to get through both of these boxes in one video. And if you could do me a favor and make sure that the front of the box is facing the camera when you hand it to me, okay, Pumpkin? Sure. So this box is second, so don't touch those until we're done with the first box, okay? Good you go. All right. Let's go, guys. I'm going to tell you value as we go through these. I'm excited. We got two opportunities to get Children of the Force or that alien pop. And I'm going to go ahead and pull up Pop Price Guide on my phone just so we're ready to go. So I'm not looking. Don't tell me what it is. Um, do you already have the first one out? Yep, I have the first one out. Okay. Does it look exciting to you? Meh. It's a meh. Okay. <laughs> One, I don't know, I'm not looking. One, two, three. <laughs> this is a pretty cool pop. It's Vivian Ward um, from Pretty Woman. So I love the outfit that she's wearing in this one too, by the way. That's the one I, I really like. Um, but I have this one, but this is an awesome pop. So my daughter doesn't know what Pretty Woman is. Um, so I would understand why it's a meh for her. But I do have the pop, and unfortunately... With these mystery boxes uh, you do end up getting some common so this one is worth ten dollars that is the value on that box okay sophia give me one second okay so i'm going to put vivian ward down here hand me the next one. Oh, by the way is there anything in a soft protector or hard protector in this box and uh, no 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 okay <laughs> here we go so we don't have a Children of the Forest or the Alien, but we can still have a cool pop. Is this one a cool pop? Um, I think to you it would be okay. <laughs> that scares me. Here we go. Al Bundy from... <laughs> uh, so this is the exclusive. Um, to me it would be okay. I do have this pop, but it is a cool pop. It's a Target exclusive. Um, so let me put that in and see what he's worth because we're going to do pricing on these. There was no, that I read, I don't remember, there was no guaranteed limit, so, I mean guaranteed uh, amount. So that's a $14 pop, um, not bad. All right, so that puts us at 24 so far, we paid 40 bucks. That's not in a protector? No. Okay, it just feels like it's brand new then, like super new. Yeah. And super packagey, like super slick. It's almost like a different style of box. Okay, you can let go, sweetie, I got it. Okay. One, two, three... Is that the, uh, I'm not looking at the camera. Is that the Baskin Robbins one or is that the normal one? Okay, it's the normal one. So we got the normal Steve from Stranger Things. I love Stranger Things and I love this pop, but I already have it because I collect all the comments. I bought all these the day they dropped, but this is a cool one. And, um,. That's him just holding the ice cream cone right there. So this is a pretty cool pop. Um, he's new, so I don't know if there's going to be a value. But let me put him in. Okay, so you can hand me that first box. So that Steve is worth $12. So we have a total of $36 value. Okay, I was just looking at this. $36 value, and uh, we paid $40. So we got, you know, most of our value back. All right, let's open up the second one. Now, I want you to fill in there first before you, well, do your thing. If there's any bubble wrap, remove the bubble wrap, all that stuff. Was there bubble wrap in this one? Okay, there was bubble wrap in this one. For some so. reason, the bubble wrap soft. Okay. <laughs> to me, it's like very, very really soft. Oh, okay. Jeez, okay. Okay, that one's packaged. It sounds like it's packaged a little bit differently from the first one. Because I can hear her ripping through some bubble wrap there. Okay, I'm ready for the first one. Okay. 
Now, I want you to hand me whatever exclusive there is in that box, hand that one to me last, okay? Or if there's, first of all, is there, I know there's an exclusive because it says so on here. So is there, is there any soft protectors or hard protectors in that box? Uh, it doesn't look like it. So that's a no. Okay. So can you, can you look at all three pops without showing them to me? Yep, I did. Okay. So whichever, is there one with a sticker on it? Some type of sticker? Yes. Don't tell me where from, okay. So that one handed to me last, okay? Okay. All right, because that might be a valuable one. I don't know. But we don't get Children of the Forest. We don't get the Alien because there is no soft or hard protectors. Doesn't mean we're not going to get a cool pop, but we aren't going to get those. Unfortunately, out of 100 boxes, we are 0 for 2 on those for Father's Day. But the first one was $36 value. Not bad. But I have all three of those. Here we go. First one, please. Madame. Madame Rosel. Here we go. One, two, three. Ooh. Okay. So, I actually have this entire series um, that looks like hubs from the back of the box. Yep. So, I actually have all three of these. Um, they dropped in 2015. So, these should be vaulted soon, if not vaulted already. Let me check. Um... I'm going to put Fast and Furious because I want to see what the other ones are worth. Okay. So Hobbs is worth... Okay, so Luke Hobbs is worth 11 bucks. But, um, so the second box, $11. And so um, Brian O'Connor, rest in peace, um, in real life, rest in peace, Brian O'Connor's worth 20 bucks, and then you have Dom worth 15, and then you have The Rock, Luke Hobbs, coming in at $11. Okay. All right. So $11 pop. All right, but these are going to go up, and none of them are vaulted yet, which I'm surprised because you don't find them in shelves anymore. So they made, it looks like they made right around, most people that, that registered theirs are right around 4,000, maybe 5,000. So they didn't make a whole bunch of these. So when these do get vaulted, they are going to go up in value. Um, because there, there's only three pops ever made for Fast and Furious. And Luke Hobbs is about to drop his movie um, with uh, that other actor that fights. I can't think of his name. All right. So eleven dollars. Next one, please. Is this one a good one? I, th I'm in my opinion, I think it's cool. You think it's cool? Okay. Is it a human or a character? It is a character. Okay. All right. One. Please be something good. Two. Three. Ah oh, man. So this is cool, but I already have it, and it's not the glow in the dark version either but that doesn't mean he's not cool but I do collect the commons so yes I already have molten man so so far we are five for five I have all five of these um, let's see what molten man is worth and let's see what kind of value we're looking at here so that he's worth the glow in the dark is worth 17 and this one doesn't have a value yet so we're gonna list him as 10 because the twelve dollar pop at the store, so I'm gonna list them as ten bucks. The exclusive is seventeen dollars. The glow in the dark. Okay, so this is the exclusive one. What do you think about it? Is it cool? Not cool? Um, so so far we're at twenty one dollars, by the way. I mean If my daughter's saying I mean this this doesn't sound good. <laughs> Alright. I so, mean it's meh. It's, it's 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 an exclusive and it's meh? I mean it's because I don't really like the. I don't really. I don't One, want two, to spoil three. it. Yeah, I'm not going to spoil it. Oh, yeah, that's a meh. Because <laughs> why? Because I already have them. But this is still a cool pop. And the glow on him is pretty cool. So we got Skull Trooper from Fortnite. I have this one too. So this is the thing about these Funko Pops. Um, wow. So. Skull Trooper, oh, I put Trooper, and all the Star Wars stuff came up. So, 
Let me redo this. Skull Trooper. So these are $40 boxes. We're already at 20, 21. And this one is worth 13. Okay. So that puts us at $24 value. Um, no, I'm sorry, $34. I can't do math. So $34 value. So altogether, we're down $10. Not bad. Not bad at all. So we have 36 and 34 with the two boxes combined. And that puts us at a $70 value and we paid 80 bucks. Okay. The value wasn't bad, but we're starting to get into that territory where I already have all six of these. And um, because I collect all the commons and that's the problem with mystery boxes is like Sean Ryan said, you're going to end up with a separate room of duplicates. Um, so we'll see if I buy another one. It probably won't be from from this company, uh, Spastic Pops. Um, I want to try somebody different. N nothing wrong with them. I've got some great pops from them. I just want to try somebody else. And, uh, you know, I got the, the blue Vegeta from Gotcha Robot. So I'll probably do a Gotcha Robot. Or maybe I'll try Chrono Toys. I'll look around and see. Um, but I'm definitely going to order from a different company just to see. I'll probably do one more and then go from there. Um, and we'll see. we'll see how we go. Um, but thanks for watching guys. Sophia, thank you for your help. You're welcome. High five. Please be kind to one another and uh, we'll see you guys on the next video.